Hey, friends and family, this is SP with another news nugget. We're going to talk about Steve Harvey. He's in the news again. So subscribe to this channel and I'm going to drop that nugget. Steve Harvey is having a hard time. So you guys, let me drop that nugget for you. Hey friends and family, this is SP with another news nugget. We're going to be talking about Steve Harvey. Now you guys know, last week I did a video letting you guys know that Steve Harvey show was being canceled. Well, Steve Harvey got some more problems going on. Steve Harvey has been let go from, you, you guys know the, uh, the show called... Um, What's that show called? The Little um, uh, Little Big Shot on NBC? Well, they're letting Steve Harvey go. And you guys, they're giving uh, uh, the position to a lady called, her name is Melissa McCarthy. And uh, they're saying that she's funny and all this. I've really never heard of this woman. So if I haven't heard of her, she probably not all that funny, but they're giving all his positions to women. And a lot of people don't know why. What like what's going on? You guys know that Steve Harvey has sold a lot of his property and, and his businesses. Here, here he's taking them out of um, his name and uh Marjorie's name and putting it in his business name. That lets you know that if he goes through a divorce, which we do know. That that's a big possibility that um, Marjorie's not going to get all, all that money that she thinks. Now, she probably get a little bit because, you know, Steve Harvey did adopt her kids. But here, let me, guys, let me tell you guys what happened. Okay? Now, Steve Harvey met Marjorie, married her, knowing that she used to be married to King Penn. So, so Steve Harvey, so Marjorie got Steve Harvey's head in this cloud and she's so beautiful and she is beautiful. And so Steve Harvey adopts her kids because she's like, my kids don't have a daddy. Their daddy is in jail. So Steve Harvey adopts her kids. Now Marjorie's doing the right thing. She doesn't take, took, um, you know, this a uh, wife thing to a whole different level. She embraced the kids and everything, which that's what you're supposed to do. But a lot of women, it's hard to do. She's done it. She's done it. She really, I think she actually really do have feelings for his children and made it one big family. Anyway, so Marjorie asked Steve Harvey to uh, go to the president, President Obama, and ask him to pardon her ex-husband so her kids can have a family. You guys hold on. And Steve done it. He went to President Obama and asked him to do a favor because, you know, when you're in them high places, you can ask people for favors. Well, President Obama pardoned King Penn because, see, King Penn had a life sentence. And now King Penn is out. So President Obama pardoned King Penn. Now he's out. Okay. So, I think Marjorie is, is really not a good thing on Steve Harvey's side. But anyway, so then uh, Steve Harvey goes up and meets uh, Donald Trump. Now, I don't know what the conversation was about, but I'm pretty sure there was probably some more favors that needed to be done or said or whatever. But anyway... You guys, Kingpin is out, and Kingpin is writing a telltale book. He said he don't owe Marjorie nothing. He is upset and mad because not only that his kids is taken out of his name and put in Steve Harvey's name, but uh, Marjorie actually left him for Kingpin's cousin. And here's the big ticker. Here's the big nugget. And I'm going to say allegedly because I don't want to get sued about this. It's supposedly um, said that not only Marjorie helped with a lot of the drug deal because, you know, he was found with so many. What was it like? Forty eight 
uh, kilos or something of cocaine or whatever that he was going to try to sell. I, mean, I don't know if that's a lot or a little, but I mean, it sounds like, you know, 48 and then you say kilos. I don't know. But anyway, if that's a lot, that's a lot. But anyway, you guys, not only that, you know, she was dealing in drugs, but she's also known as a lady of the night. You know, one of those pros, allegedly, like a prostitute or whatever. So I think, you know, when he comes out with his book, because they're knowing what's going to go in this book. And um, Steve Harvey is married to Marjorie. It's going to make a lot of these um you know, uh, companies like, you know, NBC and ABC and CBS and, and, you know, all these companies look bad because here you got this woman that, you know, drug, you know, had, you know, dealings, drug deal, dealings. And, and then not only that, you know, she's prostitute and stuff. And Steve Harvey is married to her now. And, you know, people change. I look at her. I don't, I, when I look at this lady, her name, Marjorie, Harvey, you would think, no, you know, she's a very beautiful lady, but you just never know. You just never know. Okay, you guys. My time is up. I want you guys to always be good, be safe, and be nice to each other. Happy Monday.